Hello, RPG Game here with a quick update about my experiences with Monster Hunter on the Nintendo Switch. As we know, I got it imported from a shop in Stafford, and the game is 98% Japanese. So when I first played it, I was rather confused. But being a Monster Hunter veteran, or Monster Hunter knowledgeable of the franchise, I know how to negate my way through the menus, and so it's not so bad once you start playing it. I have to say it is very, very good. That's being biased because I quite like the Monster Hunter franchise. The Pro Controller is absolutely 100% worth it. I cannot stress how much of a godsend it is. 100% worth it. £65 worth every single penny. It makes the game an absolute breeze. Can't wait for Skyrim when that comes out. That'll just be so perfect with this. And going back to the fact I don't understand any Japanese, I've decided to learn myself some. As you see, we've got Cantana, which the game primarily uses. There are some letters and words, symbols, should I say, that uses other other um, other Japanese, but it mainly uses Cantana. There are some words which sound like they do in, in English. So one of the one of the styles is is translated to Sudoku, which goes to striker, and Gerudo, which sounds like guild. I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong. I started to learn it about two days ago and so far I'm really enjoying it and I, I really enjoy the fact that all the different symbols are two or three different letters and it's helped me through, it's helped me through the game learning different monster, um, monster names and all that. So yeah, if you do like uh, Monster Hunter, I do recommend it but you need to be knowledgeable of the franchise though otherwise you'll get a bit lost with the menus. And once again, if you don't have a pro controller I recommend, 100% recommend that you buy one. And I'll see you soon with more Monster Hunter updates.